Hello, my name's Alex McGrain, and thanks very much for joining me in this video, if you're watching. So I've had quite a good idea about what videos to make next for this channel, and it's an interesting one because it gives me a chance to talk to you more, and it gives you a chance to get to know a bit more about myself. Uh, I'm going to answer some music related questions. Um, it is relevant to this channel. This is a music channel. But some of the questions kind of seep into personal stuff as well. Um, music is very personal to me, so it's not really a surprise that this may turn into more of a personal Q&A. But uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I'm going to be doing it in a few parts. I'm going to answer five questions in each video. Um, I tried to do a video with um, 20 questions, but it was just too long uh, to upload. So I'm going to be doing five questions in uh, each video. And um, hopefully you enjoy uh, this kind of video, a uh, Q&A session. And uh, so, yeah, let's get into it. So the first question what is your favourite genre of music? Okay. Well, first of all, I'm not closed off to any type of music. I, I don't dislike music. I like all kinds. But if I had to pick a favourite type, it would be indie music, particularly indie music in the 2000s. Largely British music, but... I like some American indie music as well. Uh, I just think 2000s indie music is so honest. Uh, it doesn't pretend to be anything it's not. Um, it might not be the best technically, you know, musically speaking. But in a way, I think that adds to it. And that, that, kind, of mu that kind of music is really the reason behind me writing and starting to sing and really becoming passionate about music and um, if it wasn't for that type of music I, I really wouldn't be as into music as I am now so that that is what I'd pick if I had to pick the next question what is your least favorite genre of music okay well, as I say, I'm not closed off to it. It's just that I don't get it. Um, heavy metal music in particular. I, myself, can't relate to it. Uh, I've sat through loads of songs um, and really listened to them. and It just doesn't speak to me. I, I guess I'm, I'm not the target audience for, for it. But there's just nothing about heavy metal music I can relate to. I can't relate to the people, what they're singing about, or the music. Um, but I, I was speaking to a guy who he said, once you get over the rough sound that heavy metal music has, and you start to appreciate the lyrics a bit more in a different way, um, you do start to understand heavy metal music uh, so maybe I will one day, I don't know, but for now I'm at a bit of a loss um, with heavy metal. So if I had to pick a least favourite genre of music, it would be heavy metal, but we'll see. So the next question, how often do you listen to music? Okay, well, every day, certainly. Uh, most hours of each day. Um, you know, when I'm walking to work, I've got my earphones in. When I'm walking back from work, I've got my earphones in. Come home, I put music on. Um, I probably listen to about two albums worth in a day. Um, that's normal, but I'd say even when I don't listen to as much as that, it's at least 10 songs in a day. So very often is the answer to that. Uh, I feel like I have to. It's just pure escape. Um, and that is why I listen to it. 
uh, a lot because I just find an escape from it and you know like all your worries do just go away when you've found something that you feel so strongly about um, and I feel music is that for me when I'm listening to it so yeah very often question four in what ways has music impacted your life okay it's a good question I think there aren't many ways that it hasn't affected it um, it's impacted my life massively it's impacted the way I dress, uh, the way I talk, um, the way I walk even. Uh, it's impacted my point of view on things, uh, my outlook on life in some cases. It's affected pretty much everything in my life. Uh, it's impacted me massively. Uh, there are some people who I think I'm one of them who live and breathe music on a absolutely addicted to it. Um, music is an addiction, um, I will admit that. I am addicted to music, but I don't see it as a bad addiction because it's had such a positive impact in my life and it hasn't done damage, you know, it doesn't cost you money to listen to music unless you're buying the music, but you know, you know what I mean. Um, you know, it doesn't do harm to your body or anything like that. So. It's impacted me in the fact that I'm addicted to it, but I see it as a good addiction, if that makes sense. So yeah, in every way, it's impacted my life, pretty much. So the final question in this Q&A is, who are some of your favorite artists or bands? Okay, well, a few that spring to mind straight away are The Killers, Oasis, uh, The Stone Roses, Pulp, um, a lot of uh, the Britpop bands like uh, Manchester Music, I like The Smiths as well, but I like a lot of older music as well. Uh, of course, I like The Beatles, uh, The Rolling Stones, The Kinks, The Who. Um, as for current bands, I like Arctic Monkeys, uh, the Fratellis, the Cortinas, um, so a lot of uh, that indie music really, they're, they're a lot of my favourite bands. Uh, as for favourite artists, I would say Elvis Presley, uh, Bob Dylan, uh, Richard Ashcroft, uh, I like, well, Obviously, I like both the Gallaghers. I like Liam Gallagher and Noel Gallagher. Noel Gallagher in particular um, is, he's possibly my favourite artist um, ever. So yeah, uh, Paloma Faith as well, I like her. Uh, so yeah, there are a few that spring to mind, uh, but there's loads of others that I like, uh, but they probably come high on the list. Okay, well, it feels like we've only just scratched the surface, really, with this q and I've only answered five questions, but I will be back with another part of this q and uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any questions for me yourself, uh, you can leave them in the comments. I'd be more than happy to answer them uh, and get back to you. So I'll see you in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care.